everybody. It's Melissa from Buckeye Girls Reason Things. We're going to paint some candy corn. This is just a triangle. Thad brought in a bunch of these triangles. And I painted it on both sides orange. That was my base paint. And now let's add some yellow. I just took, uh, this is painter's tape, and I just wrapped painter's tape around it to keep our orange orange. And then I'm going to just paint this section yellow. And I want it rustic. This candy corn is going to go on a garland for my mantle for fall. And it's going to have candy corn and it's going to have ghosts. And I will be doing a video on how I make the ghosts as well. And this I didn't get straight, so I'll just pull that back. Straighten that up. Hey, Chad. Hey, Linda. Prayer for your mom, Chad. I'll pray for your mom. So many people are sick right now it's, and, and having so many problems. I'll keep her in my prayers. I just doing a quick yellow paint on this. And it seems like the since this is reclaimed wood, it really draws in the in the paint really well. And I don't want my yellow to be orange. Okay, and now I'm going to do a little bit of white. And I want to make sure to get the edges because with it hanging on my fireplace, you'll probably be able to see the edges. Okay, now I'm going to set this aside and let this dry. And here's some of my dried ones. So I'm going to pull the tape off. I'm going to pull the tape off and see how bad it is. Hey, Laura.
And I figure it's not going to be perfect. I can always go back and touch it up. I'm just making making it more straight. And I'll let that dry and see the yellow came through here and then go back and touch that up. Because you can see the orange on there. And I got tape on my paintbrush. No, I don't have a monthly group. I have a design group and that's welcome to the public and is free. That where we share our designs and I need a paper towel that's wet. I have a YouTube channel, I have a blog, and I have a design group. That's what I have. Hey, Kathy. Yeah, I have a YouTube channel which has all the vid almost all the videos I've ever created. Uh, cooking, design, crafting, all the videos is in YouTube. I I have a blog that I'm starting that will have that'll eventually have a bunch of my designs and videos there. The good thing about acrylic paint is if you make a goo goo goof up, you can get, get some water and wipe it up. But yeah, and I my design group, it's just a place for all of us to share our designs and if you have a question about a design or hey do you think does this does this wreath look good with a bow or w better without one kind of thing you can post it in there and and uh, we'll help you because there's a lot of great designers me and uh, Barb uh, from bling your door to court runs it Jessica. 
But yeah, so no, I don't have a group where it's paid. I leave that to Damon and my business coach. He's got a design group and he's got a business coaching group. But I don't. Yeah, and you're you're more than welcome to jo join the design group. Anybody can. There's a lot to having a paid group, and I just uh, with my YouTube channel and everything else. It's too much for me. I think I don't do my videos out here, so I'm not used to doing doing them here. This is on my kitchen out in my kit in my dining room. But I've been doing a lot of wood stuff with that. We have one um festival that hasn't canceled, so we have to make sure in case it still goes on that we have stuff for the festival. So I've been painting some wood stuff for him. Yeah, I, I'm gonna make them really rustic. I'm gonna make some ghosts. And the ghosts are gonna to be too stinking cute. Especially these all these were with scrap pieces of wood from the wood shop. My husband brought me in a five gallon bucket of these pieces and said, honey, can you make something with these? And I said, yeah, I think I can turn these into, those into candy corn. Carolyn, you know you should be doing a video vlog of, of uh, redoing your craft room. I'm turning my craft room around. I'm going to be in the same place. I'm just spinning everything around. If you go back in my videos, I've spent spin my room around about twice. So now I'm gonna go in another direction again. But no, it's been three times I spun my room around.
I seen somebody took these and they made them rustic like I'm gonna do. And then they turned them in and, and they put a top hat on them, on the candy corn, and put a face on it and made it look like a little person. I've seen that I think on pin interest. I thought that is interesting. Hey Elizabeth. I'm just trying to make this a little more even across and straight. Hey Barb, Barbara. She normally says, I'll see you tonight. The bad thing about Reclaimed is it really takes the paint. Okay, now we'll go back to the first one. Now this is the part I like. And this is just some brown paint. Okay, I know I have. taking an old rag. I use these for everything when I paint and stuff. I always have a bunch of these and I'm going to take and dip this rag into the paint, into the paint and I'm going to just rub it on, on the block. I know everybody's saying, you're messing that up. And then I'll go back and I'll wipe it off.
white right there faded out a little bit too much. And that's how I'm going to do those to make them look old and uh, primitive for my mantle. This one I'm going to probably do lighter than the other one. The fun part is they'll all be different. Hey Bandit, do you want out? You want out, buddy? He has me where he wants me here too. And they turn out looking really kind of dirty. As I used to say, uh, rustic primitive, that's old and dirty. That's the style of that. Also brings out the wood grain and when you wipe the brown on it it brings out the wood grain and the rustic elements She's making me some t-shirts, girl. Should I tell? Amy's making me some t-shirts at Three Princesses. And a sign. Guess I shouldn't tell till I get it, should I, Amy? Shouldn't have told. I got a new logo. I don't know whether everybody's seen it yet or not, but I got a new logo and I just got new t shirt. Amy's making me some t shirts for my new logo. It's the little turquoise truck because I have to have something that will look okay and 
Mr. Sawinski don't mind. It goes with his wood stuff and my floral too. Yeah, Amy's working on the new logo. Uh, the t me some t-shirts and some and and a sign with the new logo on it. It's kind of hard, you know. I you don't want all flowers and stuff because Thad does all this woodworking. And I'm doing more painting of his wood stuff. Yeah, I like the new logo, especially the way it is on my YouTube channel. Because I have the background that's an old piece of wood. And it's got na and it's got nails. It reminds me a lot about Thad's woodworking. Okay. Hey, Sandy. Hey, Rose. I didn't know you were here. Haven't seen you in a long time. Hey, guys, I'll let you go. I'll be back in a little while, and we will be making some ghost for this garland. Because we're going to have candy corns and ghosts on this, on this garland. Talk to you later. Bye.